Basketball Jones. I know. She knows Cheech and Chong. Steve, thank you very much. And now we're talking ag with Donna Hughes. The and, uh, out. Yes. Big news, Donna. First off, good to see you. But uh, big news in regards to the um, uh, corn production in the USDA this week. Yep. What did we um, find out? We had uh, the USDA release their quarterly stocks and prospective planning report on Tuesday. And mm -hmm. uh, there was a little bit of a surprise in there for uh, the corn producers, and uh, so consequently, uh, we may see more corn acres planted than what we originally thought. So the good surprise. So this is good news. Um, it could it could be good news. Uh, depends uh, on depends on which way you look at it. Okay. Um, you know, we have to get some more demand going to uh, even that out a little bit, but. Uh, there's a lot of corn around. Okay, I was trying to think so positive there. You know, folks in California have not been so positive right now with, uh, with the drought situation. Can what's going on there affect us here in the Panhandle? Oh, absolutely. It can affect um, the entire country as far as uh, consumer basis goes. Um, you know, a lot of the uh, fruits, vegetables, nuts um, that's produced in California, um, if uh, that production drops off, then a lot of these um, items will have to either be imported or um, you know, the, the pricing on it, um, mm -hmm. you know, you'll probably see an increase in the pricing, so. Okay. I posted on Facebook about a half hour ago. See this cat right here, Chris Soles of That's The Bachelor? That's Chris. Why the heck is he popping up in our ag report this morning? Well, you know, uh, Chris is a producer from Iowa, and he's been asked by the National Pork Board to be a celebrity judge in um, Pork Producer of the Year. Okay. And um, this is open to anybody in the country. And so if you go on the Pork Board's website, you can get the information on how you can submit mm -hmm. uh, and nominate somebody for Pork Producer of the Year. So he will be one of the judges. Uh, we could get a winner from right here in the Panhandle. Absolutely. Say down heart. Could be. Jeannie Nguyen went on my Facebook page and she posted under his picture, well, hello. <laughs> But allegedly, he's taken, so. Allegedly. Allegedly. How do we get a hold of you for real, though? <laughs> you can give me a call at the office at 418-2293. Donna Hughes, you're the best. Well, thank you. We'll see you next you Friday. You're the best. Cool. Uh, quit playing like that. Come on. <laughs> Stick around more of the show after this.